Hello everyone, this is Rick from the King Sacrifice YouTube Chess channel. Today we are going to look over the Hello Sir trap. So white starts with d4, d5 and here white plays e4. Black will obviously try to capture the pawn and we can attack it by playing knight to c3. Black defends and we can offer our another pawn. Black captures and white takes with his queen. Black captures on d4 and he is two pawns extra. And now we white can just play bishop to e3 attacking the queen. And over here black can play queen to g4 exchanging the queen which would be the better move for black. But we are looking over a trap, so we'll see what happens if black plays queen to b4. And now white can simply cast on the queen side. Black will play bishop to g4, pinning the queen, and on the next move, he's gonna take the rook. But now white's got a better move than that there is knight to b5 attacking on the c7 square and threatening checkmate and now if he tries to take the queen then it's just game over and if he plays e5 we can play knight takes c7 check king moves to e7 we can take the b7 pawn and now we are attacking the queen and if he tries to take it we can checkmate with our bishop and you also notice that he doesn't have any good move to play because we are going to play the knight on the another move giving a discover check so what's better over here and now what happens if knight plays a6 protecting the c7 square we can again take the pawn on b7 by the queen and if bishop takes d1 we can take the rook giving a check king to d7 and we can take the pawn on a7 and now you can see that white's attack is much powerful than black's so now we can look over the another move that is what happened if he plays rook to c8 if he does so then we can just take the knight on the a6 and you can see the color on the board if it takes our rook we're gonna take his rook and delivering a checkmate so this was all about today's video do not forget to like share and subscribe thank you for watching the video see you on the Next.